Hello guys, welcome back. It is a Thursday. I actually got back from Hobart just yesterday. Nick is out with some friends tonight and I just really feel like having a girly Jess kind of night. You know what I mean? I'm going to cook something that I've been craving for a while. I'm going to put a face mask on, watch some really shitty reality TV. You guys know I love that. And just like take it easy because that is honestly the best thing to do after you've been away for a couple of days. For whatever reason, I've really been craving San Choy Bao, so let's go to the kitchen. I've actually never made San Choy Bao before and I am so excited to eat this. I sort of tried it a little bit while I was cooking and it tasted delicious. So this is just like very exciting to me right now. I'm gonna pair it with some sweet chili sauce, although it probably does not really even need it. Oh wow, that was, that was a lot of sweet chili sauce. officially onto my second face mask of the night. I have such a busy week coming up as it's fashion week here in Melbourne starting on Saturday and I'm gonna be out I think every single day until next Friday night and on Sunday night we're actually going glamping at the Peninsula Hot Springs which should be really fun. I've never been glamping before so it's actually kind of rare at the moment just to get a night to myself and to be able to just like cook something, relax, watch some TV and just chill out. Before we continue with this video, I want to say a huge thank you to my sponsor, which is Rojas. I have seen this brand pop up a bunch of times on my Instagram, but also my YouTube Explore page. I've seen like reviews and people styling the different pieces and all the rest of it. So I was really excited to experience it for myself. And I was really excited when they reached out to collaborate. On first impressions, I was actually really pleasantly surprised with the quality of the pieces. Given it is priced quite reasonably, I just wasn't really sure what kind of quality to expect. The quality of the pieces is actually really good. And as you'll see during this video when I try everything on, the styles, the cuts and everything are really beautiful and are very well aligned with my personal style aesthetic. I often get requests to share brands that are more reasonably priced or sit at a lower price point. So I was really excited to share this brand with you guys and I hope you really like the pieces that I selected. Jumping right in, the first outfit I wanted to share with you was this cute black singlet and checkered skirt look. The cherry on the top is so cute and the skirt is super versatile. It could be worn in a spring summer outfit like this or it could also be styled with tights, a jumper and boots for winter. I liked this first top so much I wanted to get it in the white too. In both colorways the fit is perfect and I am wearing a size small. The material is thick and soft on my skin and has a bit of stretch to it. The brand has a real French elegance to it as well so you can definitely feel that in these items here. Next up I selected a few dresses to show you as options to wear for upcoming events. The the white one is perfect for a ladies lunch, a dinner date or something similar. The cut is elegant and chic and again quite versatile in that it could be styled for different seasons 
and dress up or dress down just depending on the occasion. The second white dress is a beautiful white linen dress that feels perfect for a summer picnic. I particularly loved the slit down the side making it feel romantic and feminine and I can definitely see myself wearing this a lot while the weather is still warm. The last dress is probably the least my style out of everything that I selected, but I know a lot of you often request affordable wedding dress options, and I felt like this one would be the perfect wedding guest dress to show you. The next look is the perfect workwear outfit. I honestly couldn't believe how perfectly the black trousers fit me. They were so comfortable. The cut was beautiful, chic, and perfect for an office or even just like a casual setting. I paired them with this ribbed black top, which again fit really well and would also look really great as the weather gets cooler paired back with a trench coat or oversized woolen coat. Finally, I wanted to try out a pair of the Rojas jeans, so I styled some blue straight leg jeans with this blue singlet. I love the little daisy details on the singlet. It reminded me so much of the kind of pieces I used to love when I was younger, which added a bit of nostalgia to this outfit. The jeans were also a great fit and also the perfect length. I hope you guys loved these outfits. Everything will, of course, be linked below as well as all the sizes that I took for each item. Anyways, that is all. Let's get back to this vlog. Good morning. I have quite a few meetings today ahead of fashion week next week, showings and just picking some things up that I'm going to be wearing over the next few days. It's really pretty, it's like the green one. Yeah. yeah. I love that. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> David Jones and got our outfits for the runway show tomorrow for Fashion Week. I'm here with Maxine and now we're just getting a little drink. I'm drinking a chai because they don't have matcha and what do you have? I'm drinking beetroot juice. It tastes like the earth. I wouldn't recommend. I wouldn't recommend the beetroot juice from Maker but I would recommend the chai. The coffee very was good. good. Jones runway show tonight. I'm gonna quickly show you guys my outfit. Keeping it super simple tonight. I've just got on some Miu Miu heels. I'm obsessed with these. Black cargo style trousers, which are from the Frankie Shop. A little black singlet, which is from Kukai. Frankie Shop blazer. Both are available from David Jones. And my current go to favorite little Celine bag. Anyways, let's go. Cool. a bit of a hangover today definitely feeling the alcohol from last night after the david jones show but anyways we're going glamping today i'm so excited we are just stopping to get some petrol gonna get some acai bowls along the way and gonna head to the peninsula hot springs i got the pb and j except i get it without banana because i find it too filling otherwise and it gets the gone nuts bowl tent. 
I don't know what I was expecting, but this is so nice. We have a huge shower and a really cute little bathroom area. Really nice big bed, a little reading corner. There's just like a toilet through there. This is like the little front yard. It is so cute. I can't wait to get into our robes and check out the hot springs. back to the room we've had a shower we're back in our robes and we're now just going to head across to dinner i got the duck with salad and i've got the box cheek with potatoes and kale 